Hello friends, I'm Dragon Age, and welcome back to some more Doctor Who. This is the name of the Doctor, and as you're watching this, I am probably still away. So enjoy. Something wrong. Obviously. The Can't you hear the beeping? Shop. What kind of idiot would try and steal a faulty TARDIS? A faulty TARDIS? This must be Gallifrey. Ah, oh, there we go. So do we get to see now the Doctor st <laughs> stealing the TARDIS? Doctor. Doctor. Yes? What is it? What do you want? Clara. Sorry, we're about to make a very big mistake. I don't know where I am. What? It's like I'm breaking into a million pieces and there's only one thing I remember. I have to save the Doctor. He always looks different. Doctor! I always know it's him. Sometimes I think I'm everywhere at once, running every second just to find him. Doctor! Just to save him. This is weird. What? He never hears me. Hi. Almost never. I blew into this world on a leaf. What? It's still blowing. I don't think I'll ever land. I'm Clara Oswald. I'm the impossible girl. I was born to save the doctor. I'm actually super confused at the moment. Do you hear the whisper men? The whisper men are near. The whisper men. If you hear the whisper men, then turn away your ear. Do not hear the whisper men, whatever else you do. But once you've heard the whisper men, they'll stop and look at you. Okay. One silence. I have information. You have the blood of 14 women on your hands. There are no words that can save your neck. The doctor. Oh, uh, it is Vastra. It is. Uh, I know all about him, your dangerous friend. How? In the battle of the world. There are whispers, if you know how to listen. Doctor has a secret, you know. He has many. Obviously. There's one he will take to the grave. His name. And it is discovered. Lies. We can't let that terrible man live. He I don't believe him. I understand what he told me. I'm going to need a conference call. I'll send out the invitations. You fetch the candles. Yes, Mom. Are those the whisper men? Where's Strax got to? The usual. This is weekend off. Oh, so what is he doing? I never discovered that place. Oh, God. He just goes to bar fights? Prepare to die in agony for the glory of the Santaran Empire. Excuse me, Master Strax. What is it? All right. Girl. Girl. Can't you see I'm trying to crush the brain Again. of this stinking primitive? Still. Sorry about this. No problem. It's a telegram. Uh -huh. Okay. Very urgent. He, he finally learned to, to figure out... He, he finally learned what a girl is. Conference call. But now he's still fucking it up. Sorry, Archie. I'm going to have to ask you to render me unconscious. Bane. Well, oh, that's not going to happen. Might take a while. Ah! Well. Sleep well, my love. You too. He's going to be here with them with a, uh, a dent in his head. Oh. Was there a face out the window there? The doctor's friends. There is. So who and what is that? It's the whisper man. Doctor's friends will die in you. Yes. Desktop. Mm, I was getting a little bored of the Taj Mahal. Mm. Okay. Tea should be superb. It's drawn from one of my favorite memories. <clears throat> what is this? Good of you to join us. It better be important. I was in the middle of destroying some very pleasant primitives. 
I apologize uh -huh. for the interruption, but okay. there is urgent news concerning the doctor. Who else is coming? The women. The women. Oh no, you're gonna try and make a souffle again, aren't you? My mum's souffle. Yeah, although this time I will get it right. This time hmm. I will be souffle girl. Of How course you will. Mom? The souffle isn't the souffle. The souffle is the recipe. What's this? <laughs> My dearest Clara, the doctor entrusted me with your contact details in the event of an emergency. Assuming this letter will have reached you as planned on April the 10th, 2013, please find and light the enclosed candle. Hmm. It will release a soporific which will induce a trance state, enabling direct Great. communication across the years. Hmm. Oh, oh, oh. However, Ew. oh no. no reason to trust this letter. I have taken the liberty of Great. embedding the same soporific into the fabric of the paper you are now holding. Oh, good job. Speak soon. So, she's there no matter what. Anyway, okay, well, that's a little so rude. glad you could make it. Where am I? Exactly where you were, but sleeping. Time travel has always been possible in dreams. Uh -huh. We are awaiting only one more participant. Oh, no. Not the one with a gigantic head. It's hair straps. <laughs> Who is this? Hair. <gasps> oh, of course. I should have known. Help yourself to some tea. Obviously, it would be River Song. How did you do that? Disgracefully. Hilarious. This is the doctor's companion. Uh, At the moment. His current traveling assistant. Assistant? Have you got a darker green? Clara Oswald. Professor River Song. Okay. The doctor might have mentioned me. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, of course he has. Professor Song. Sorry, it's just I, I never realized you were a woman. Mm. Well, neither did I. Yeah, but you don't know anything along those lines. Perhaps anyway. Get down okay, to well. Clarence DeMarco. Murderer. He offered us this in exchange for his life. Space time coordinates. Ah. Oh. Is the location of the doctor's greatest secret. Which is? We don't know. It's a secret. The doctor does not discuss his secrets with anyone. If you're still entertaining the idea that you're an exception to this rule, ask yourself one question. What is his name? Well, I know it. You know his name, he told you. I made him. How? It took a while. A little more than a friend. He still never contacted you. He doesn't like endings. Of course not. Okay. So what else did this demand? Well, you should tell them what you're feeling. How did he a word I've heard in connection with the doctor before. Trenzalore. Trenzalore. I remember er, it, I How think. How exactly did he describe what he was giving you? It sounds familiar. The doctor has a secret. He has one he will take to the grave, and it is discovered. Misunderstood. Sorry, I, I just realized I forgot to lock the door. It doesn't matter, Jenny. What misunderstanding? Tell no, me. No, Mom, please. I should have locked up before we went into the trunk. Jenny, it doesn't matter. <gasps> yes, it does matter. Someone's broken in. Someone's with us. I can hear them. <gasps> Jenny, are you all right? Sorry, Mom. So sorry. So sorry. So sorry. I think I've been murdered. What the fuck? Jenny, what's happened to her? Jenny, can you hear me? Speak to us, boy. Jenny! Oh my god, now's not the fucking you time. Just wake up now. Just wake up. Do it! Who are you? What have you done to her? You two strikes. Wake up now! <sighs> Oh god. Oh, they're there after him. Oh shit. Tell him what? His friends are lost forevermore unless he goes to Trenzalore. He can't go there. You know he can't. The doctor can never go to Trenzalore. What is it? Angie, party. Am I getting warm? Look, I'm pretty sure you have to tell me if I'm getting warm. I'm 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 I'm, I'm pretty sure that's in the rules. Talk to her. Ha! Clara, everything is under control. Is it? Are you sure? I don't think it is. <sighs> What the fuck? The kids. Uh, so Jenny's dead. The cinema. No, not until you wake up. I was very far. At which point they suggested Blind Man's Buff. Yes. Where are they? Gone. At the cinema. The little Daleks. Daleks. What's wrong? Who was she? Lady with the funny name and the space hair. An old friend of mine. What? Like an ex? Yes, an ex. River asked Vastra for the exact words. What were they? The doctor has a secret he will take to the grave. It is discovered. And it was Trenzalore. It was definitely Trenzalore. Yeah. Why? What does that mean? What is Trenzalore? Sorry. Trenzalore. I've heard the name of course. I remember it. I remember it. it. Yes. 
I've always suspected what it was, never wanted to find out myself. River would know, though. River always knew. Give me your hand, now. The coordinates you saw will still be in your memory. I'm linking you into the TARDIS telepathic circuit. Won't hurt a bit. Ow! I lied. <laughs> of course you did. Okay, what is Trenzalore? Is that your big secret? No. Okay, what then? When you are a time traveller, there is one place you must never go. One place in all of space and time you must never, ever find yourself. You didn't listen, did you? You lot never do. That's the problem. The Doctor has a secret he will take to the grave. It is discovered. He wasn't talking about my secret. He's talking about where he dies. He has been found. He was talking about my... His grave. Grave. Trenzalore is where I'm buried. How can you have a grave? Because we all do somewhere out there in the future, waiting for us. The trouble with time travel, you can actually end up visiting. But you're not going to. You just said it's one place you must never go. And now it say, seems to be... Jenny too, if it's still possible. Oh, but I they, hope so. I hope they can save Jenny, because what the fuck? Never questioned me, never judged me. They were just kind. I owe them. No point in telling you this is too dangerous. None at all. How can we save them? I'm glad she's on the way. Apparently, by breaking into my own tomb. <laughs> Wonderful. Uh, but the TARDIS doesn't, doesn't like it. Yeah. Of course. course. My own timeline in the biggest way possible. The TARDIS doesn't like it. Of course not. Uh, poor TARDIS. Oh no. Oh my lord. How how is this okay? It's a little bit more than just fighting it, isn't it? <laughs> Poor TARDIS. She's shut down. We must be close. Okay, so that's where I end up. I thought maybe I'd retire. What <laughs> colors or beekeeping or something? Beekeeping. <laughs> Apparently not. So, how do we get down there? Jump? Don't be silly. We fall. She's turned off practically everything except the antigravs. Guess what I'm turning off. The antigravs. <laughs> oh. Poor TARDIS. <laughs> <laughs> I was surprised it actually cracked. Visiting your own grave, anyone would be scared. Probably time traveled more than anyone else. Meaning? My grave is potentially the most dangerous place in the universe. Gravestones are a bit basic. Battlefield graveyard, my final battle. Why are some of them bigger? They're soldiers. Bigger the gravestone, higher the rank. And his is going to be gigantic, isn't it? Absolutely massive. It's <laughs> a hell of a monument. It's the TARDIS. I can see that. No. Oh, it's actually the TARDIS. When the TARDIS is dying, sometimes the dimension dams start breaking down. All the beer on the inside starts leaking to the outside. It, it, it grows. What? So I don't mean it looks like the TARDIS. I mean it actually is the TARDIS. My TARDIS from the future. What else would they bury me in? Clara, don't speak. Oh. Don't say my name. He can't see or hear me, only you can. Well, come on then! We're mentally linked. It's the conference call. I kept the line open. Okay. Who are you talking to? We need to get... River. Oh. That can't be right. No, it can't. She's not dead. Oh, she's dead, I'm afraid. She's been dead for a very long time. Yeah, probably should have mentioned that. Never the right time. But I met her. Oh, that's unfortunate. Wrong story. But her grave can't be here. <sighs> Doctor! This man must fall as all men must. The fate of all is always dust. If it isn't my gravestone, then what is it? Uh -oh. What do you think that gravestone really is? A gravestone? Maybe it's a false grave. Maybe it's a false grave. Yeah, maybe. Maybe it's a secret entrance to the tomb. Maybe it's a secret entrance to the tomb! Yes, of course. Makes sense. They'd never bury my well. wife out here. Oh, well, no. Uh... Why? I don't understand the rhymes. This is very disturbing. Why was Jenny killed and these two weren't? Is it because Jenny's just human? Lay down your weapons and your deaths will be merciful. Jenny! Jenny! Oh. This planet is now property of the Santaran Empire. Surrender your women. Maybe she's not actually dead. Strax, please! She's dead. Oh, come on. No heartbeat. Complete cardio collapse, shock induced. Get her back for me. Get her back for me now, or I will cut you into pieces. Unhand me, ridiculous reptile! So, holy fuck. <laughs> huh? There we go. Just a standard electro cardio wow. restart. She'll be fine. That was all she needed, huh? I feel oh, like she was dead for long enough for that to not be possible. But okay. <laughs> Just a couple little coughs. Well, at least she's still alive. Oh, this fucker. Only attracting your attention. I presume I have it. Simeon, the 
This is not possible. And yet here we are, meeting again, so very far from home. He died, you told me. Sin yes. Died. But the creature that possessed him lived on. I take it I am now talking to the great intelligence. Welcome to the final resting place of the cruel tyrant. My ass. Of the slaughterer of the ten billion vessel of the final darkness. The tomb of the doctor. So how come I met your dead wife? Oh, well, you know how it is when you lose someone close to you. I sort of made a backup. What? I died saving him. In return, he saved me to a database in the biggest library in the oh. universe. Didn't even say goodbye. He doesn't like endings. I suppose that's true. I do remember that. But she, what? It was a minor skirmish by the doctor's blood-soaked stand. But she was Not older exactly the... when she died. Maybe we're talking to the dead river, but hmm. blood soaked. The Doctor has been many things, but never blood soaked. Tell that to the leader of the Sycorax, or Solomon the Trader, or the Cybermen, or the Daleks. Doctor lives his life in darker hues, day upon day, and he will have other names before the end. Storm, Beast, the Valiard. Even if any of this were true, Valiard. which I take the liberty of doubting, how did you come by this information? I am information. You were a mind without a body last time we met. Supposed to stay that way. Alas, I did. Oh. Gross. As you can see. What the fuck? Yowza. Clara? Clara. You're fine. The dimensioning force is this deep in the TARDIS. It can make you a bit giddy. I know, I know. How do I know? How do I know that? How does she know that? You're fine. Have we? Have we done this before? Oh. We have. We have done this oh. before climbing through a wrecked TARDIS. <laughs> Things I'm not supposed to remember. We can't do this now. TARDIS is a ruin. The telepathic circuits are awakening memories you shouldn't even have. Why do I keep meeting you? The Dalek Asylum. There you! <sighs> Clara! Clara, what's wrong? Do you mean you keep meeting me? You said I died. How could I die? That is not a conversation you should even remember. What do you mean I died? How does he remember it? No, she won't. No, she won't. Fuck you. Key is a word. Word is the doctor's. Here I am, late to my own funeral. Jenny. Interesting. Open the door, doctor. Speak. Open your tomb. No. Because you know what's in there. I will not open those doors. The key is a word lost to time, a secret hidden in the deepest shadow and known to you alone. Yeah. The answer of to a question. I will not open my the tomb. Answer to a question, Doctor, Doctor Who. What is your name? You will not get it. The doctor's friends, stop their hearts. No, Man you will not. Boys, combat formation. They are unarmed. So They're unarmed. Well, uh, they have arms, which is good enough for them. Your name, Doctor. Answer me. Doctor. Do you want me to do that again? Okay, Doctor. so you can't even kill these. That's messed up. Stop it, Doctor. Who? Unhappy, sir. Leave him alone. Let him be. Don't worry, sir. I think I've got him rattled. <laughs> oh my God, he's so funny even now. He's ridiculous. What? The TARDIS can still hear me. Lucky thing. It's in indoors as being so useless. Why did you open the door, sir? I had them on the run. <laughs> I didn't do it. Oh my god. I didn't say my name. She did. No. But I did. Is everyone all right? She said it only in a Is way that okay? the TARDIS could hear, I suppose. Because we can't get to get to know what <laughs> his name okay? is, of course. No, that was not nice. No, no, I know. I'm sorry. Mr. G Intelligence, whatever I call you. Do you know what's in there? For me, peace at last. For peace. you, pain everlasting. Won't you invite us in? How about now? Suck it. What were you expecting? A body? Bodies are boring. I've had loads of them. So that's him. That's not what my tomb is for. But what is the light? It's beautiful. Should I destroy it? Oh Should my god. Doctor, explain. What is it? Of course it? he wants to destroy it. She wants to freaking destroy Tracks everything. My tears. Less poetry, Doctor. Just tell them. Time travel is damage. It's like tear in the fabric of reality. That is the scar tissue of my journey through the universe. My path through time and space. From Gallifrey to Trenzalore. Uh. 
my own personal time tunnel. All the days, even the ones that I, uh, ones that I haven't lived yet. Uh -huh. Doctor! Doctor! No. No. Doctor! Which is why I shouldn't be here. Because he's going to um, uh, know things he shouldn't know. No, what are you doing? Somebody stop him! The doctor's life is an open wound. It can be entered. It will destroy you. Not at all. It will kill me. It will destroy you. I can rewrite your every living moment. Every one of your victories into defeats. Poison every friendship. Deliver pain to your every breath. What you go through, you can't come back. You will be scattered along my timeline like confetti. Uh. You thwarted me at every turn. Now, you will give me peace as I take my revenge. Every second of your life. That's extremely Goodbye. psychotic. Goodbye. That's actually extremely psychotic. Well? What's wrong with him? He's being rewritten. Miel is attacking his entire time. He's dying all at once. The Dalek Asylum. And Asani. What? what did she say? The Dalek Asylum. The Dalek Asylum. Now he's dying in run with us. It is dumb. It is dumb. So this is why. So Clara goes back through through here. This is why he keeps meeting her. Oh dear goddess. What's wrong? The universe without the doctor. There will be consequences. Jenny, with me. The Dalek Asylum. You said it was me that saved you. How? Victorian London. How? How could I have been in Victorian London? <sighs> because she went through there. No, please. Stop my life. My whole life is burning. What are you scanning for? Local star systems. Why? Because they're disappearing. The doctor's timeline has been corrupted. Is every the victory fuck? reversed? Think how many lives that man saved. How many worlds? He saved your life when we met. And she's gone. No. Jenny? Oh, fuck off. Please, Jenny! No! Reptile scum. <gasps> oh, no. You affront to some tarn purity. Prepare to perish. My friends, Strax, your past is changing. But I swear, we are comrades. Die, reptile! Strax! What the Strax. fuck? What the fuck? I have to go in there. That's such a mess. Please. No. But this is what I've already done. Yeah, and this you is why me do it. you still know. The impossible girl, and this is why. Whatever you're thinking of doing, don't. If I step in there, what happens? The time winds will tear you into a million pieces, a million versions of you living and dying all over time and space, like echoes. But the echoes could save the doctor, right? But they won't be you. The real you will die. They'll just be copies. But they'll be real enough to save him. Wow. It's like my mum said. The souffle isn't the souffle, the souffle is the recipe. What the fuck? It's the only way to save them, isn't it? Yeah. The stars are going out, and Jenny and Strax are dead. There must be something we can do. Holy shit. Well, how about that? I'm souffle girl after all. No, please. If this works, get out of here as fast as you can. Spare me a thought now and then. No, Dara. Oh my god. In fact, you know what? Run. Run, you clever boy. And remember me. No. Holy shit! Clara! That's I messed up. Running. That's not what I expected. I'm born, I live, I die. Always I'm running to save the doctor again and again and again. Don't steal that one, steal this one. The navigation system's knackered, but you'll have much more fun. Right from the day he started. Interesting. Running. Run, you clever boy. And remember me. Wow. It was an unprovoked and violent attack, but that's no excuse. We are all restored, that's all that matters now. We are not all restored. You can't go in there. It's your own time stream, for God's sake. I have to get her back. Of course, but not like this. But how? Is she still alive? Huh? Kill Dr. Simeon. Clara's got yes, an advantage but... over the great intelligence. What is that? Which is? Me. Doctor, please listen to me. That's true. At least hear me. That's true. I don't come back, and I might not. Doctor! Go to the TARDIS. The fast return protocol should be on. She'll take you home, then shut herself down. There has to be another way. Use the TARDIS. Use something. Save her, yes, but for God's sake, come be on. sensible! How are you even doing that? I'm not really here. You are always here to me. Wow. And I always listen. And I can always see you. But didn't you speak to me? Because I thought it would hurt too much. I believe I could have coped. No, I thought it would hurt me. Mm. And I was right. Well, of course. That wasn't very fair. Since nobody else in this room can see you, God knows how that looked. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Just like, what the fuck? <laughs> okay. A little bit of comedy to break it up. But okay, sure. There's a time to live <laughs> and a time to sleep. <laughs> you are an echo, River, like Clara, like all of us. In the end, my fault, I know. But you should have faded by now. It's hard to leave when you haven't said goodbye. Then tell me, because I don't know. How do I say it? There's only one way I'd accept. If you ever loved me, say it like you're going to come back. Well then, see you around, Professor Riversong. Till the next <laughs> time, Doctor. Don't wait up. Oh, there's one more thing. Isn't there always? I was mentally linked with Clara. Oh. If she's really dead, then how can I still be here? Okay, fine. Now. Spoilers. Of course. Goodbye, sweet. Then I suppose that means he does come back. I was born to save the Doctor. But the Doctor is safe now. I'm the impossible girl. And my story is done. No. Not completely. Duh. Not at all. Your story's not done Duh. at all, Clara. Please, I don't know who I am. <laughs> Clara. You can hear me. I can't see you. I'm everywhere. You're inside my time stream. Everything around you is me. I can see you. All your different faces, they're here. Those are my ghosts, my past, every good day, every bad day. I'm inside my own time stream, it's collapsing in on itself. Well, get out then! Not until I've got you. I don't even know who I am. You're my impossible girl. I'm sending you something, not from my past, from yours. Look up. Sorry. From this her is past, you, relief. Everything you were or will be. You blew into the world on this leaf. Hold tight, it will take you home. Clara, Clara, come on. I can do it, I know you can. How? Because it's impossible, and you're my impossible girl. How many times oh. have you saved me, Clara? Just this once. Just for the hell of it. Let me save you. You have to trust me, Clara. I'm real. Just one more step. <laughs> my Clara. And what's that? Is that Simeon? The intelligence? Who's that? Never mind. No. Let's get back. Uh, who is he? He's me. There's only me here, that's the point. Now let's get back. But I never saw that one. I saw all of you. Eleven faces, all of them you. You're the eleventh doctor. I said he was me. I never said he was the doctor. Oh, I don't understand. Oh. My name, my real name. Okay. That is not the point. The name I chose is the doctor. The name you choose, it's like, it's like a promise you make. He's the one who broke the promise. Oh. Clara? Clara? Come on. He is my secret. What I did, I did without choice. I know. In the name of peace and sanity. But not in the name of the doctor. Interesting. John Hurt. As the doctor. What? Introducing John Hurt as a doctor. Oh. What the hell? So that is the great intelligence defeated. I suppose. See, this is why time travel messes with you. Damn. That was a good one. That was an emotional one. I like it. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you again soon. Bye bye. God bless. Keep coming. Dragon.